Today, Kansans from across the state gathered to advocate for the end for the end of stigma around mental health. 13's Callie Holtis is in the studio this evening. She has more to share. Callie. Today, the National Alliance on Mental Illness hosted a 5K walk at Topeka West High School to raise awareness for these issues. Let's hear what they have to say. The National Alliance on Mental Illness, or NAMI, takes a community-based approach to supporting people battling mental illness and their families by offering a variety of resources like educational programs and advocacy. When you're looking for resources, sometimes it's just like, well, where do I, where do I find it? And that's why we're here. That's why we do what we do. For, it's for the people and the people in those communities. Many of those who participated in today's walk have first-hand experience with mental illness, whether it be personal or a loved one. I had a family member who had a severe mental illness, struggled off and on for, for many years. We were able, through the help of NAMI, to get her the help that she needed and, and the support that she needed. Peyton Keller, Miss Kiowa County, chose mental illness as her platform after her own struggles with her mental health. I am so thankful to the people of NAMI and educating not only me, but everyone of Topeka and everyone of Kansas. NAMI's work already reaches across Kansas, but hopes to incorporate all 105 counties into the network in the near future. And each part of the community is very proud of what they have to offer, and we, we're here on this National Day of Hope to celebrate that. Callie Holthouse, Channel 13 News. Those interested in joining or hosting a NAMI Walk for Mental Illness can find more information online at namiwalks.org.